Hello from Lviv. Rainy and cozy Lviv. The last time I was here was before the war, full scale war. So we arrived here for an occasion to celebrate my birthday. I always try to celebrate my birthday somewhere far away, but not at home. I love Lviv. Of course, I recommend and want and actually like to uh, come here in summer, spring. Summer terraces, cafes, uh, just on the streets and parks, beautiful uh, views. So, yeah, but still now it's also like good weather. Uh, it's warm, it's uh, 10, almost 10 uh, degrees by Celsius. Uh, it's like spring, uh, spring weather, I would say. We got to Lviv by car, but one of the best ways, the most comfortable and fast, is to take Ukrazelaznitsa train, Ukrainian railway. You can get from Lviv to Kyiv and vice versa by a comfortable sitting second class train. It takes around 6 hours and costs around 10-12 US dollars. So, I would like to share room tour with you. This is our small room. This is our small room in the hotel on the square. Uh, the hotel is located in the city center, just right on the square Plosha Rinok or Rinok, Rinok Square. This is the main ratusha on the square. Amazing view. So let's go to the bathroom, which is already checking if uh, everything is fine. Um, bathroom is super nice, modern, clean. Uh, it has these showers necessary things like lotion, shampoo, everything looks great. Hi! And the floor is warm, I like it. Thank <laughs> you. 
going to climb Bratusha to see the view from the top. Uh, I, of course, I was uh, there many times, but I like this atmosphere from from the rooftop or how to say it. Uh, yeah, so I'm going by myself because um, my husband left with Lichi in uh, in the hotel room. So yeah, it's kind of uh, interesting trip because we for the first time took our dog and uh, we have to handle it <laughs> somehow. <laughs> This is very hard way to climb to Pratusha for people who are not prepared for this will be difficult.
The next stop is a must-visit place for beer lovers. This is a beer theater Pravda. Pravda means truth in Ukrainian. Pravda is a Lviv-based brewery that has already become popular in the world. The restaurant has three floors and its own beer market. It offers a wide variety of beer, local and European brands. They provide an incredible mix of tasties. I definitely recommend visiting. Heading to the birthday cocktail in one interesting bar, uh, which offer uh, like authentic or unusual cocktails with unusual gradient ingredients. So we want to try. Lviv is a city of music then when my dad uh, came here for the first time uh, his first observation was that uh, so many singers and so many music music uh, is here in Lviv Good morning from Lviv. Today is our last day in Lviv. We are getting back to Kiev. Uh, now I will have an interesting meeting. My follower, Carrie from America, from the United States, wrote me that um, she watched my vlogs and likes it, and she lives in, Ki in Lviv, sorry, and would be great to meet someday. So we are Lviv now, and I texted her to uh, meet up for a cup of coffee. So now I will have a short walk, and uh, I think it will be interesting to ask her something about Ukraine. If she doesn't buy, I will share with you. So, yeah. Uh, hi, Kerry. I want to uh, introduce you to my <laughs> followers and ask you uh, your story. How long you are in Ukraine and uh, what are you doing? Yeah, I've been here for about four months now and planning on staying. Um, and. It's not my first time to Ukraine. I've been here many times and I used to live in Ukraine. So for two years, I was a volunteer English teacher uh, in Southeastern Ukraine and I still teach English now online. So I decided to move back because I really miss Ukraine and I want to try to help as much as I can. Cool. So you are living in Lviv now and uh, many uh, foreigners, many people want to come here to uh, to Ukraine, like the first stop or uh, the first city they want to see. So, would you recommend to come here? How about the safety? Lviv is super beautiful, really nice city. Um, a lot of cool places to explore. It's like there's a small risk coming now during the war. Of course, the chances of something hitting right where you are at the at that exact moment are small. So, like for people coming for a couple weeks. 
like you probably will be fine. So it's it's up to you what your risk factor is. Um, but if you're here for a long time, there's bigger chances you will hear or be around explosions. So it's not super safe, but um, a lot of foreigners do come and enjoy it. I've met a lot of international volunteers from all over the world. There's some cool um, centers where you can volunteer at. in Ukraine we take like a picnic outside in Lviv city center and these petty style chairs looks nice Lviv croissant with turkey and this with uh, chicken this is like a Lviv uh, brand uh, they make stuff croissant with different uh, fills, so sweet or bitter. It's tasty.